Try mi raza, aquí estamos en vivo desde Wunic. Aquí andamos en vivo desde Wounded. Today we got my boy Shrek in the motherfucking house. What's Arsenal efectivo in the hey. building, you know what's up. El viejo con el compa Christian Halo y a unos compas. ¿Cómo se llama, compa? I'm Mint, motherfucking El Menta, Mint Creations in the house. Wah, 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 wah. That's right, got my boy Mint Creations and JC. Este, los voy a pensar bien rápido. Shrek, Cushman, JC. Los cabezas de Drug Dealer Music, Nueva Izquierda, expect it real soon, viejones como no. Mean Creations, the head of design. So if you see why we looking so fresh, you already know why. That's what's up. Drug Dealer Music. Brrr. That shit defines you. Brrr. I already like it. I want a shirt. Have, you don't even got merch yet. I already want a shirt. Man, it's I have a marketable title, you know, like hell yeah. Shirts, hats, everything, man. Right now, we, I'm working on the Instagram page, YouTube channel, everything. We've been keeping it super in the cuts, man. I have it, I've been really low. Man, you guys go look at my Instagram and everything. It's, it's all archived. I've been just, I had, to, I had to just disappear, man, to do this right. And I've been just polishing my stuff up. But before we get to there, man, let's talk a little bit about our history, man. Compa, like, first of all, I want to say thank you for coming, compa. You know, I've known you for years. Uh, I remember when you went to, uh, to my house in Compton and you played, I heard for the first time, uh, Vida Peligrosa. Right there with uh, Marito Aguilar and uh, Bajo Loche. That shit, I never knew that song was gonna get to where it's at right now. And I respect you, everybody loves you, everybody in the industry loves you. You introduced Bajo Loche to the fucking industry. And that, look at us now. You know what I'm saying? Hey, mi respeto, viejo. Aquí estamos a la orden, ya sabe, eh. Como Muchas siempre. gracias, Rubén, ya sabe. Puro bonde, viejo. ¿Y dónde andaba, viejo? No, pues, mire. First of all, man, thank you for speaking on behalf of the industry. I, I, I hope that's what the industry feels like. Thank you so much, compa. La neta, I'm, I'm very proud of, of the influences that I've been able to, to, you know, put into the music, you know. Um, but besides that, man, like, pues, pues, uh, man, you know, pues el inicio de Arsenal y todo ese pedo, it's a dope thing, it's a dope thing, man. You know, uh, the whole SMO thing, Rancho Humilde, um, un desmadre que yo, el Javi, el Poncho hemos hecho, uh, but... You know, it, 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 the evolution of music, where it's at now, all these, all these new bands, where Bajoloche has gone from where I initiated it to what it is yep. now, what music is now. You know, I've been sitting in the cuts and I've been working on some stuff, compa, and I'm very happy to be here too. Compa, you laid it out for everybody to play it out. It took one person to do that idea and yeah. make it happen and look at everybody. Look, I, rec I have a music studio here, as you know, and, and we record Bajoloche daily. And that wasn't done before, you know what I'm saying? You need to get, you need to get at these by Holo Che, by these companies. And like, hey, yeah, I don't want up, that 13%. Man, I, 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 that was, I, I was talking about that, man. Yeah, we got to definitely merge all that, you know. Uh, pero este, um, no, pues, uh, I'm, I'm very proud to, like I said, be, be uh, such a big influence in, in, our, in the new sound of music, right? But like I said, I tell everybody, I try to stay humble as much as I can and, and, and also say that. It's, it's a bunch of us, man. We, we as musicians, we all inspire each other. We hear each other. We make new music from hearing each other. You know what I mean? And I'm just glad that everybody heard the Bajoloche, liked it, and decided to, to use it. You know what I mean? Okay. And I'm, I'm not trying to say that, that I, I, whatever. Whatever people want to say, they want to put me on the credit on that, that's, that's awesome. I I'll take definitely it put you on the credit, <laughs> Macombaya. How do you feel that, it, how, it got, how far it got this Tololoche thing? Did you even know it was going to get that far? I, I did not expect it to be what it, what it was going to be, what it is now. You know? Hey, wait, pero dile acoustic bass porque se van a enojar, güey. Si no dices, güey. Si no dices acoustic bass, se van a enojar. So, 
Hay, que, hay, que, hay, que, hay gente ahí que, que no, no les sé. gusta la, el nombre todavía bajo loche, pero yo, yo, lo, yo, lo, yo lo usé, yo lo empecé a decir y, y de ahí la gente lo agarró. Bajo loche. And it's, it's it. It's, it's stamped in, in the industry as, as bajo loche. And it's crazy. I talked to a lot of people oh, and, wow. uh, and, and it's an, an instrument in itself. You know, la gente, it's crazy because a lot of people que toca bajo loche, they don't know how to play bass. You know? That's true. I got that here a lot. And it's crazy because I didn't... And it, It didn't come into a realization until now that I'm working with artists and trying to get bajo locheros and bass players. And we're like, oh, we got a badass bass player. And, oh, yeah? Y el bajo loche? Oh, he don't really play like that, though. He, you know? And yeah. What do you mean? Or we got a badass bajo lochero. Yeah? And, but he don't know how to play bass, though. He don't yeah, know how to do bass that. adornos or nothing. Like, oh, what the? You know, it's a whole instrument in itself. So that's a pretty dope thing. It's like I feel like the introduction to the bajo loche with Shrek was this. Uh, back in the days, we used to do the whole fucking playing in your backyard, playing in somebody's backyard, a fiesta privada, because, you know, that was what we would do, you know, to make a little bit of money or whatever. And he would, we would get to places on the estaban los vatos tocando con tololoche, pues. Y llegaba Shrek, and he would play the tololoche like a bass. And the to tololocheros would be like, hey, estás tocando como bass, no puedes tocarlo como, you know. And this food didn't know better. He was like playing, you know, so... That like white people, they don't, they don't. They yeah, why don't? So that right there, he was like, "Fuck it, I'm gonna play the acoustic bass like a tololoche, and that's what I'm gonna do, and that's what he did." And honestly, that's the style right now that's banging. If you don't got a bajoloche on your shit, if you don't got a bajoloche on your shit, your shit ain't banging. Like Nate Dog, you know what I'm saying? Like if you ain't got Nate Dog on the track, shit ain't gonna bang. And that's some West Coast shit right there. The bajoloche has West Coast all day, all and we're day. gonna claim that's that right here with my homie Shrek. From Santa Maria, California. Yes, sir. You were trying, hey, you know to, do, trying to do it. Talking about Nate Dogg. Shouts out to my boy, that's, Inhale. That's where the Nate Bajolo came from. You know what I mean? I got to collab with him. Uh, little, little quick meeting. I got to meet him. And, uh, you know, so look, we mentioned his pops. I want to mention Inhale. Shouts out to my boy out there. So, so you've been laying low for a while. I know you got some trouble with the law. You went to jail. You know, it's been a while since I've been here. It's been a while since I really do interviews or anything like that. So for the people, you know, for everybody here, I really want to talk a, a little bit about the past. Uh, the present and in the future. So the past, you know, the initiations of Ajoloche, we're talking about that. Um, Arsenal Efectivo, uh, what it is. Um, the Smoke Me Out tour, everything we've been able to accomplish with that, the evolution of music, yeah, right? That shit was bad. So everybody knows the history that uh, during that whole time, I was on probation. And because of probation, I was limited on doing, you know, anything really. So it took me a year to finish the album of Seguiremos Trabajando because uh, probation. They, they, my priority was doing shows because the shows couldn't wait for me. The studio could wait for me. And because of that, it took me a year to record that album and to put it out. Because of that, the year, the music, the album, the idea, the mentality was old, I feel. We, I feel like we all talk about it and we're like, if eh, Seguiremos Trabajando was put shortly, maybe like six months after, And La Fuga, I feel it would have been another platinum album. You know? It would have Every been. album you've done been a fucking hit. Thank you, thank you. Immediately, like, all these musicals all over right here, they just start, like, the next day, you already know your song, you know? And that's, that's a dope thing for me. I, I know I know that in the music game, in the music musicals, I got a lot of appreciation. But at the end of the day, the numbers is where it's at, you know? And Seguiremos Trabajando didn't give me the numbers that, that En La Fuga gave me. And... Mainly, like I said, restrictions, man. And once, once <coughs> probation was like that, I had to go with the flow, and I just did what I could. So for three years that, that I was on probation, I didn't do anything, man. And and I, I we we as Arsenal went with the flow uh, that that the career was giving us or whatever, and the, that that life was thrown at us because of probation and all that. And and this and it ended up for us having to kind of disappear from the game, you know. So this last year. In this last year, I said, now we archived our stuff. You know, the whole pandemic happened. That the up. SMO, I haven't talked to Jimmy about another one happening. I don't know if there is or not. I'm not saying there isn't one happening. I don't want to, you know, Jimmy to be cracking down on me later. Like, what's up, you know? I don't know. I haven't talked to him about that, about another SMO, so I have no idea if that's happening or not. But prior to the pandemic, it was SMO every year. Boom, 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 boom. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? And I think it's, it's the Arsenal Efectivo tour now. With the new well, look, everybody's doing, up and everybody's doing their tours now. Yeah. So we're, we're working hard right now. Drug I'm working dealer hard. Tour. 
on working, we're working with Drug Dealer Music Rap, my record label, then we got Mala Fama, that's Javier Poncho, and I'm really work, um, working, hard, we're working hard on polishing up this project to give you guys a Trap Corridos tour by next year, you know what I mean? So if everything goes right, Drug Dealer Music, Mala Fama, is gonna be on the map. Hell yeah. Trap Corridos Here's tour, coming real soon. Fuck it, fuck. I'll take a shot to that shit. I know you're right, shot. This is the, the Shrekoloche shot right here, real quick. That's right. Take a shot. Take a shot. Take a shot. Saludcitas. I know he doesn't like. He only likes Bucana. Man. You know, man. I'm going to take him home. I'm going to take him home. I'm going to take him home. Si no se, se nos echa una, usted tiene una botella ahí, una botella. Y a mí ya no me den porque lo... su madre! Y no mal, viejo. A la vez, Custom Bay uh, just finished on the lab today. You know, la que sigue es Louis Vuitton. Neta. But I need a bag for my bottle. You a bottle, yeah, motherfucker, you gotta hit me up. You need that. that. Golden you need that. Alcoholico. You need that. That's right, my boy. Go ahead. No, pues saludos, viejo. Ahí tiene todo el Jesus juice ahí, el so este compa ahí. The present is basically you got these niggas going right now that you're gonna bring in. You got the new record label and 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 what's the future for you right now? So right now, I'm still an artist signed under Rancho Mille. Right? I'm still under contract with them and we still plan to work with Rancho Mille as Arsenal Fictivo all day. You know what I mean? I know Rancho Mille has histories, whatever, with their artists or whatever. Me and Jimmy and them, you know, we've kept a, a, a good relationship and we're gonna continue yeah, to me work. Me too, shout out to Jimmy. Yeah, def definitely, Simon. I salute Al Jimmy, Rocky, JB. I, I think the uh, Arsenal Cero, Efectivo my fans want to know what's next for Arsenal Efectivo. Well, Arsenal Efectivo, this is what it is next, viejo. And I'm and this is I'm gonna I'm gonna put this in the preview for Drug Dealer Music when we put out material. I'm gonna play back the clip when I did the interview with Pepe Garza when he went to go pick me up at the feds. Y hoy, precisamente hace algunas horas, acaba de terminar su sentencia. ¿Tres años de prisión, viejón? Casi, casi los tres, dos y medio por ahí. You guys picked me up at the feds, pero Pepe Garza, Pepe Garza, Garza the went to go pick me up straight out of the feds. Free shred. We gotta shred. mention that one. Shout out to my boy Pepe. We're gonna be in Pepe's yeah, office. Wait, 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 he ever went anywhere to go do anything with anybody, like, you know, that, and I was surprised that he, he did it, like, he was like, I'm, I'll go, where's he at, because I, I told him, you know, he's getting out of jail, he's blah, 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 he's got this song out, okay, I'm, a, he went, so that was cool, shout out to Pepe, Pepe Garza, amen, but the reason why I mentioned Pepe was because I'm going to put a clip of when I did the interview of with him, and he asked me about that, and I told him, Trap Corridos, and I say in the interview, Bruh. I say <laughs> that Trap Corridos isn't the sound that I want it to be yet. I said I have an idea for what I want Trap Corridos to sound like. It's not what it is yet. I say that in that interview, and then I, I wasn't able to do what I needed to do because of my restrictions. But you know what? I've been off probation for a year now, and I've been laying low in the cuts, working on some fire. So right now, today, Sir. I'm going to be introducing for you guys the artists that I'm working with. But we're going to do a part two to this interview where I'm going to be showing you guys the new sound. You know what I mean? So I, I disappeared from the game. We were talking about it for with the guys, and we're like, you know what? Arsenal, we disappeared from the thing. What's new for Arsenal? Well, all these guys came with the Corridos Tumbados. And they paved the way for the new sound that I'm about to introduce. Because I feel like if I would have introduced it back then, it would have been too crazy. But now, with, with everything that's happened, all these collaborations, having Ovi, who's a reggaeton and sings corrido, whatever, that kind of thing is, is just our music is so expanded now, so evolved now, that I'm able to introduce the sound, and I feel the people are going to accept it more. The right me. time. You know what I mean? It's the right and time. And you said it yourself, but what did you say earlier? As uh, the, 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 the what of music. The what of oh, corridos? This is the Dr. Dre in the tumbado business. We didn't even call it tumbado. It was way something else. Now I'm saying I'm having him say it. He, he laid it out for us to play it out, man. Look, who, who ever thought that his music, his transition of music, because before, before, la gente lo que no entiende, before trap corridos, before tumbado was trap corridos, before trap corridos was corridos progresivos. We went from fucking Gerard Ortiz, yeah. Calibre 50. Who could beat that? And then here comes this motherfucker right here. And he comes with this fucking crazy ass West Coast fucking sound. 
and boom, all oh, these little niggas just woke up and say, damn. Damn, I want to play by Holoche. I want to play by Holoche. I want to play that. What the fuck and is that? And it's a rap. My, all my bands play by Holoche. It's a rap, you know, and and, 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 and that's shout out to all of them. He's a trendsetter. It's a trendsetter. Shout out to all of them. Shout out to all of them. But nah, yo, saying? but I, hey, most importantly, I want anybody who's and watching I can say this. That, anybody I'm a who's watching this right now, I want you guys to understand, man, I'm from the gutter. I'm very proud of what I've done. But I also try to remember where I came from and stay humble, man. Any anything like this, comments like this, I, I don't. I'm very proud to hear them, and I don't want them to come out of me. You guys hear that shit coming out of other people. That I did this, whatever. Z- it's coming out of other people, Certified. and I want it to be like this. That. Shit wasn't even planned. This is a real fucking my energy. own. You know what I mean? I wanted him. I, right now, when I said, "What did you say earlier?" He said the Dr. Dre because I have that vision too. Dr. Dre did so much for the West Coast and our sound. My for boy, the I mean, who's a, who's who who who? Who's the band? Shout out to Dr. Dre. Who's the band? Everybody's watching this. And the reason you guys might say Dr. Dre and all, all this, but it's because look at Arsenal can pull out an album and put three songs out, and those fucking three songs are gonna bang all day, every day, Bruh. until his next song comes out. And that's how he's working his music. It's not no Mickey Mouse shit that a song that's gonna come out, everybody's gonna listen to it, a million people, but that's it. You're not gonna listen to it for the rest of your life. So this shit is some music that's gonna come. Not only did it change the game, but it's you know it's gonna stay paved. And you guys are about to see some new shit. And you know Perrin, how it's been. One time this guy right here asked me, "Hey, wait, how the fuck did you come to L.A.? <laughs> like, how the fuck did? How are you in L.A. and how you know yourself around and how you know this and how you fuck? And you know what I mean? Shout out to my homie Chente though too, because the first time I came to Wounded was with Chente, like. Here, there was nothing there was nothing out here 30 minutes or it's free <laughs> but anyways like i said uh that's how it is you know fucking we came and from I outside want, anybody watch i don't want y'all niggas to be like hey ah, nice thing is, is, these are shrek's homies you know they, they're fucking praising them and shit it's not even like that perro i mean these are my boys and everything but like i said right now we're, we're here we've been in this game for so long we have seen so much and we're very proud they're proud that, that we have been a part of all of it. And right now, I feel like they're just spitting facts. That's it. Spitting they facts. Hey, wait, you, know, you know what's crazy is that Como for la about four or five months, we've been trying to put this together. And about four or five months ago, I'm hitting Shrek up every day. Like, I got something for you. I got some. Hey, check this out. Blah, blah, blah. And he's shooting me down. Like, you know what I mean? Like, hey, you know, no, 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 no. But you know what? We waited for the, the perfect time, the perfect day. And it's where, where we think the people's ready. Everybody's ready, you know? Fucking, we have the support from a bunch of artists, a bunch of good people. You know, my homie Ruben right here from Wounded that, you know, is, we go back, you know? Way back. And, and a lot of pe- good people came through here through Wounded, not only through Wounded, through us, as in uh, musicos being united. And, you know, we should unite a little mo- more as musicos and not have hate with it. I see all you fools hating on each other and all this shit. Bless hey, dog, people. fuck it. Take it. If you guys want to hate, there's a ring right here at Wounded Records, and we're, we're we're calling out people, dog. You guys want to get down? I'm already don't don't do that internet shit. We do that gangster yeah. shit right here. Fucking, you know what I'm saying? We're fucking south south LA right here, and you you know what's up. You guys got a problem? You guys come and solve it at Wounded Records. I got some money on it. I got the That's first right. hundred bucks on it. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, well. Don't be scared. I'll be in that motherfucker too. So you know what I mean? Well, <laughs> the, compa, compa the, Ruben, you asked me. What's new? What's new for Arsenal? What's coming, right? Exactly. You said that I, I you guys say I innovated our, our, our culture's music with this bajoloche, with this new sound. And I'm very proud to, to be a part of that. And, I, and I'm also very proud to say that the new project that I have, when we come back and I introduce this new sound to you guys, I don't want to give it out just yet. Wait on it. Right now, what I'm going to show you guys are my artists and their music. But the next time I come back, I'm going to show you the music that they made with me, with the new sound. So that's going to be sick as fuck. I can't wait, Gompa. All right, but you guys asked, what's new? A new sound is coming. I'm going to innovate the sound again. I'm going to vin- innovate our culture's music Be ready for the new wave. More. Once more, I'm going to change it up. It's going to be a dope-ass sound. Trust me, I One promise. One more time. You. Hit me up for a feature. No, no. One sure. more time. <laughs> hey, give me right now that I'm on the low low. You feel yeah, me? Serio. Como dice DJ Khaled, yeah. it's new music, new opportunities. Yeah, yeah, because you know, yeah. next year, it's going to be expensive, perro. Yeah. I want to hear your, 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 your little homie that you brought from your new regular label, man. 
All right, so this is what we're going to do. Drug dealer music coming out real soon, perros. The first artist I'm bringing up, his name is Carlos Torres, signed to Rancho Humilde and coming over half and half. Rancho Humilde, 50%. 50% drug dealer music. Carlos Torres. Vamos a presentar. Venga, se compa. Carlito. Pégale, viejo. Drug dealer music. Yo already know what's up. Bueno, mi raza, les quiero presentar a mi compita. Preséntate. Hola, ¿qué onda, raza? Mi nombre es Carlos Torres. Um, estoy muy contento de estar aquí. Saludos a mi compa Wunder. Bonita noche. Um, saludos a todos los. Toda la raza. Es un shot conmigo, video. compa. A sí, todos los yeah. compitas, toda la verga. Ese es un shot. Ok. Hey, let's show the 10 minutes later. You know what? Ah. Here at Wounded, you gotta get wounded, you feel me? A few moments later. A few moments later. Ah. Algo bien. Compa, como es su primera vez, nos tenemos que hacer un shot. Porque si no, mi ingeniero va a pensar que eres una policía. No, sí, está bien, está bien. Está bien. Ah. Pat down, pat down. Compa, se llama Carlitos. Pat that nigga Carlitos, down. mucho gusto. Me llamo Rubén González a la orden. Aquí estás. Esta es tu casa. Muchas gracias. Cuando quiera venir a grabar, lo que haga, lo que quiera, aquí estamos. Muchas gracias. Y me, mi compa me, me cuenta gratis, muchas no. más cosas de usted. Hace rato lo oí tocar en el otro cuarto y me llamó la atención, pero andaba ocupado ahí en la chingada, yo no sé. Sí, man. Pero, no, pero platíqueme de, de ti, como dice mi compa Shrek. Platícame de ti. Sí, yo. <risa> Chiquetita. No, pues yo... Um, pues yo tengo 24 años. Um, Se podría decir que soy un muchacho sencillo. Um, no me gusta hacer muchas cosas, me gusta estar en la casa. Jugar videojuegos, estar aquí valiendo verga. ¿Te y gusta nomás. limpiar, güey? No te puedes limpiar. No te puedes limpiar la casa. Es un dating show. Eh, güey. No mames. Más bien, güey. Eh, the perfect guy for the woman, for the girl. Eh, güey. This is this is an interview with Wonder Perro, but you know, para para las mujeres. Hey, back the fuck off, güey. Sácalas ya. Oh, sí, tengo tengo tóxica. Eh, güey, pero ¿por qué no te gusta hacer nada, güey? Dime, dime, pregúntame. No, no. Why don't we Why don't we talk a little bit about our history, Perro? So what's up, look? Carlos Torres, first of all, Rancho Humilde, and now also drug dealer music. Sí, Pero una historia de nosotros, de man. What's up? How do we meet, perro? Um, pues yo conocí a mi compa Shrek porque hace como tres, casi cuatro años, 2017. Este, un, me acuerdo que un compa me había dicho, eh, güey, cale aquí, güey, a um, una pisteada, güey, que um, el, el Shrek de Arsenal efectivo va a salir de la cárcel, güey, le van a hacer un. un <risa> Un kickback y yo acá dije, Kyle, verga, Kyle, el que trae la bebida peligrosa, güey. Y me dije, aquí me encuentro en el solecito. Y dije, la verga, fuck, I'm down. Y pues fui, güey, y, y pues ahí andaba de fan a la verga, pidiendo una foto, pidiendo acá, güey. Eh, güey, quiero una foto, güey. Y pues el, el Shrek todavía no me pelaba, güey. No me pelaba porque no sabía que tocaba la verga. Decía, ah, se después, me pinche eh, rompe la verga. Después te la, verga. la peló. Dice, sí, toma tu foto, pero ah, déjame en paz, güey. <risa> Um, pero lo seguí viendo, güey, lo seguí viendo. Ahí iba yo de grupo otra vez, güey, a tocar, güey, a tocar, güey. Pero nunca... Yo toco, toco requinto. Pero cuando tocaba, no me tocaba tocar requinto ni cantaba. Nomás ahí andaba de güey, acompañando. I saw this fool playing, hey, man, wait, and I, I, knew, I knew he was fucking sick from the get-go. I was like, Perro, are you in a band or what? He's like, well, I'm over here and I'm over there. And he was playing with some other fools and over there. And then it got to a point... Where me and, man, in initiations, I got out of jail, me and Javi, right, whatever. And uh, yo me lo jale porque yo dije, ¿sabes qué? Vamos a ocupar extras, man. You nunca sabes cuándo vas a ocupar un músico que sepa tu pinche repertorio, you know what I mean? Y, me, y, y se le mandé todas mis rolas. And he learned them on the spot there and then. I mean, he, he was working on, on songs at the time. So cuando yo lo, yo lo conocí... Um, ¿Cuáles roles tenías pegando o, o sa que, que habías sacado que, que estabas queriendo ya uh, con los lanzas y you want to expose them and all that stuff? Um, apenas estaba escribiendo, tengo unas rolas que, que ahí andan underground todavía. Se llaman Rolling Son Gallito y El Yamir Son. Son las rolas que tenía ahí guardadas todavía y todavía no las sacaba. Luego conocí al Shrek y me dijo, eh, güey, la neta, güey, te la rifas, güey, deberías de cantar, deberías de grabar tus rolas, güey. Es sí. de Jalisco, dijiste, ¿sabes? ¿eh? De Jalisco. Ajá, saludos a todos los de Jalisco. Saludos a todos los de Jalisco, a toda la raza. Un charro, los allá. Ángeles. Opa, ¿Y qué tiene eh, de nuevo ahorita que va a grabar? ¿Qué? ¿Ya está grabado? ¿Ya grabó? Um, pues ahorita tengo un álbum afuera. Usted, um, usted es compositor, correcto. Sí, soy compositor. Ah. Tengo vale, vale, ya tengo varias rolas afuera que están en plato. Madonas, de amor. Ah, para que sí, vayan y apoyen, de, mi de, raza. De, vayan y apoyen el álbum de mi compa Carlos Torres. Gracias. en todas las plataformas. Instagram? Um, 
Carlos Torres, nomás Carlos Torres, punto, guión bajo, guión bajo, guión bajo, ya. Let me find out you're yeah, not following no. that nigga. Come on, follow all your niggas. Yeah, 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 no, you're pero próximamente se vienen duetos acá con mi compa Shrek, con mi compa Brian, mi compa Kevin, con mis compas de mala fama, la verga. So, eh, con eh, todos los eh, que morro, yo les voy a decir una cosa. Aparte de, 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 de que soy músico y, y soy una figura, gracias a ustedes, en la música, uh, soy fanático. Yo, I'm a big fan of, of music, you know? And uh, yo, la neta, escucho más música en inglés que en español. Pero cuando escucho música en español, I'm very selective about it. Este morro tiene un sonido completamente diferente. I'm going to help him polish that shit. La gente que lo está escuchando ahorita, you guys, if you guys can't hear yet, just understand. It's coming. Con este morro, él tiene un sonido muy diferente. And I'm going to help him polish it. And we're going to collab and make our sounds. Va a ser otro pinche pedo, pero el nuevo sonido, mi raza, I'm telling you, va a ser otro pedo. ¿Y pero, se ha hecho una rolita o qué? <coughs> Simón, ah, Simón. huevo. Ahorita nos echamos una rolita, ¿cómo no? ¿Cómo se llama tu rolita? Uh, esta se llama el doble A. El doble A. Simón. Como las baterías. Ah, eh, pilas, ¿cómo se pilas? Van a dar pilas. ¿Cómo pilas? ¿Cómo pilas? Ah, Saludos a mi compa doble A, ¿cómo no? <risa> Arre, pues seguimos con, bueno, con mi compa Carlos Torres, Drug Dealer Music. <risa> Preséntate, compa. Ya está. Music. Rancho muy lejos. Carlos Torres Vijones, ¿cómo no? Uni. San Diego es su casa, sin hija en esa plaza. Las Vegas trabaja y también descansa. La Semana Santa en Puerto Peñasco tomando También con brote me la pasó bien bajado Al cien con su raza siempre se la pasa Sabe no le saca a que le amenaza Seguirán hablando a mis espaldas en confianza Pero cuando están de frente ya no dice nada Con mi compa 8 aquí estamos en corto Al Siri es el ojo para que sepan qué rollo yo no soy de envidias, pero como me fastidia Que me señalen sin ni siquiera ser de mi línea Cada quien lo suyo, pa' que no haya disturbio Tengo venta de carros para el necesitado Con un buen Mercedes siempre me miran volando También a Jan Brampiel me miran insultando pasa porque no lo comprendo siempre me pregunto qué me está sucediendo yo no estoy contento si eso que creyeron es algo distinto y no puedo resolverlo hoy aquí en mi mente mis recuerdos permanecen de aquellos tiempos cuando yo era solo un plebe jugando con mis hermanos mis tiempos pasados fuimos muy unidos pero ahora poco hablamos me casa pensarlo, pero no puedo evitarlo Mis padres están lejos de ese pobre diablo Son cosas el destino, ojalá fuera distinto Diferentes caminos, sé que no son con uno mismo Ya solo memorias quedan y no lo dejo de pensar Un sentimiento familiar que a veces me hace sentir mal Día a día pienso en todo lo que me ha pasado En veces ya no sé ni a dónde yo estoy parado Solo Dios me podrá guiar en este maldito día Muchas cosas se terminan 
pero no se puede evitar Ya solo tengo a Dios que aquí me pasa a diario Sé que pienso mucho pero eso está marcado Shrek, dígame un poquito más de los nuevos talentos que nos trajo ahorita, como aquí los, los personajes que tengo aquí. Bueno, aquí tengo a mi compa Brian Shrez, Kevin Cortez. Introduce yourself, compas. What's up, what's up? It's compa Kevin Cortez from North County, San Diego, Vista, right. California. Brian Shrez from uh, San Diego, California. That's right, right in the SD, right? Yeah, yeah right. straight out of the SD. Bienvenidos, yeah. aquí está su casa, compa. Yeah, yeah, Un yeah, estudio yeah. de su casa pa, pa. Hey, we're we connecting, huh? We, 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 we connecting. Dude. We went from the 805 from Diego, to the fucking, you know, West Coast hey, Connection. To the, to, hey. to the 619, you know what I'm saying? Like West Coast 760. Connect. Hey, lo bueno que ahí les queda cerca la línea. Dime, ¿cuántas veces a la semana vas al Hong Kong? <laughs> Ah, ya te gusta el chao, man. Ah, hey, wey, eh, este güey cruzó mi primo. They won't let him in, he said. Este no me dejan entrar, dice. At least five times a week. Ah, güey, no lo madre. Eh, güey, este güey cruzó, 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 cruzó mi primo, güey, este güey. Hey, back to the topic, back to the topic. Cuénteme un poco de aquí, de sus compas de aquí. Well, look, check it out. These guys, my boy, Brian, Kevin, straight out of SoCal, San Diego. You know what I mean? We were talking about it behind the scenes, how there isn't a lot of artists from San Diego. My boy, straight from out there. Aparte de eso, we're, we're trying to bring the whole West Coast vibe, man. Drug dealer music, West Coast connecting. And then we also got Poncho Javi, representing Mala Fama, straight from Phoenix, the Wild Wild West. Caigan le pa' acá, ¿por no está aquí al lado? Quiero... Hey, no, That's hey, my hey, brother hey, from hey, another no. mother right here. Hey, hey, hey. Man, this guy's got inside drugs for days. Vacation. <laughs> 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 hey, compadre, saludos, viejo. Hey, wait, this guy's here because of Mala Fama. Hey, ¿por qué Mala Fama, viejo? Mala fama, pues la neta, andamos buscando un hombre para pa el. Eh, güey, ¿tiene mala fama en pagar dinero o qué onda? Sí. Pues, mala fama, ¿por qué? Pues también. Sí, mala fama de culiche con las viejas, ¿ah? ¿eh? I mean, mala fama sounds pretty, you know, legit. Mala fama, you know, bad fame, infamous. Es que you know es infamous, I mean? el loco. Pues primero. All the mug shots, ¿ah, perro? Primeramente quiero mandarle un saludo a Drug Dealer Music, a todos los artistas de Drug, Drug Dealer Music, y'all niggas hard. Mala sí. fama, Rancho Humilde. Mala Flame, y Mala más, Flame. Y más que nada, mi compa Wunder aquí, that's been keeping it like legit. Bien Wunder. All these motherfucking years, dog. Compa Cushman, saludazo. JC, Así. got much love. All you motherfuckers behind the camera, you guys know what's up. Así es, pues como les digo, mis compas Mala Fama from Phoenix, putting it down real soon. You're gonna, you guys are gonna see collabs from artists from Mala Fama, drug deal music, and then a whole bunch of new material Arsenal Efectivo. Arsenal Efectivo, claro. Hey, hey, my boy, my boy Shrek and I have the West Coast like Suge and Tupac had it. Trust me, they got some good shit. All right, I'm gonna ask my boys a couple questions, you know, just you guys can get to know my boys, Brian, Kevin, real quick, and then we're gonna put it down. I want you guys to hear them. Otro pinche peo, la neta. All right, compas, grab the mic real quick. Comment, no. com comment, comment, comment on the comments right now too on their music because you know this shit's gonna be flame, comment fire. Subscribe. We want to hear the bad you know. shit, the good shit, everything you gotta say. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, Bring yeah, yeah. it. So I asked them, the, the, what's the most important question, Perro? Why are you guys yeah, yeah. here right now? Why are you guys that wounded? Nah, for I just started um, playing uh, Requinto. I just started, because I used to bump uh, Ariel Camacho. You know, I never Rest thought... Rest in peace, Camacho. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's oh, crazy because yeah, right, right, I right, asked him this question, you know. These, my boys right here, Carlos yeah. Torres, my boys out here, they're, they're fresh, fresh, you know what I mean? Yeah. And and uh, I'm going to help them polish them up, and we're going to put out some dope-ass material for you guys. But I'm going to tell you right yeah, now, yeah. he told me behind the scenes one time, he's like, fuck, I feel like my answer is generic, fool. I just doesn't give a fuck, fool. If it, that's what yeah. it is, it's what it is, yeah, you know what I mean? Nah, yeah, yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Go by your nah, mic. I wish I would have met him. Like, right? You know what's crazy? is like I met him. Yeah, he died yeah, a day yeah. after my birthday, perro. And yeah, I had seen him months before. You know what I mean? Yeah, so yeah, like, yeah, yeah. for you to tell me like, you grew because of him, it's like, yeah, that yeah. that dude lives on way. Yeah. Ese vato, way, he's so impact. He made the requinto and the, esa música, él hizo yeah. que eso pegara, way. Yeah, hell yeah, yeah. Y sabes que, ustedes, como ustedes son de acá, yeah. una cosa, way, que trip out, en la música, uh, todo mundo decía, 
si tú eras de acá de Estados Unidos y cantabas una canción de alguien de allá, te decían, hey, ¿quién te dio permiso? ¿Por qué? Esto, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, ¿Por qué estás cantando? ¿Y nah, sabes qué? ¿Sabes lo que pasó? Que empezamos a cantarle a nuestra gente, a los yeah, barrios. La primera wey. vez en la historia. Yeah, yeah. Le empecemos a cantar a los barrios, güey. A los compas que son regular homies, pero que le están echando ganas yeah. y todo eso. Y sabes y por qué? primera vez la gente de allá toca... Y sabes qué? Pegó eso. Estilo Los Ángeles. ¡Prac! Pegó, güey. Macizo, güey. Yeah. Y sabes qué? Ahorita es la pelea. Yeah, que... Yeah, yeah. ¿En qué estuvo de que la música cambió de un estilo a otro estilo? Yeah, y ahorita, yeah, yeah. what we're going to bring along to the next level is something that people don't want to hear, but they want to hear. Yeah. Now, but the that, people that don't want to hear it, it's because it's new way. Yeah. Back then, for I was in high school, I'd be bumping Ariel Camacho, you know, like all out and shit. And people would be hated on me, dog, like, ah, paisa is full and shit, like. You know, yeah. like now everybody nowadays. Es que antes no, no, yeah, antes no estaba acostumbrado que hey, un morro vestido yeah, como nosotros hey. cantar corrido. Teníamos yeah, que tener hey. tejano y la chica. We chingada. fought for that. Yeah, ¿Y cómo yeah, te yeah, llamas, dijiste? Uh, Brian Shreds. Brian, Shreds. ¿usted escribe yeah. las canciones? Yeah, Simon, I compose and uh, play uh, my so, instruments. So, so yeah. you're related? Nah, nah, we're homies. We're homies. Yeah. Everybody thinks we're brothers and shit. Hey, bro. Yeah. Hey, so, Kevin, Kevin, tell him. Your, the mic, your turn, your turn, your turn. Let them know what's up. Everyone has that shit. Why you be doing Big question, big question. Why? All right. So, honestly, like I said, like Shrek said, I, he asked me that yesterday. He's like, oh, who, why'd you start? I was like, I'm not even going to lie. It's because I did a Camacho, you know? I seen that fool uh, jamming out, just his harmonia and shit, just him by himself. Like, hella feeling that shit, you know? I was like, fuck, I want to do that shit just by myself, too, you know? Like, I just want to learn from myself. And then shit, I just, you know, we were like right here and shit. Hey, wait, you know, know what I want to do? I want to dress like a real Camacho, way. Sad, yo, huh? We're from the streets, we're over here, it's different. You got an SD hat, that, you got an SD that's hat. That's exactly what I wanted to ask right now, Pedro. I got tattoos, and let me ask, Let me ask him a question real quick. If Ariel Camacho is your inspiration, that fool and me are two different fucking artists, nigga. Like, it is. Two different. We dress, look, talk different. You know what I mean? Walk different. Yep. We eat different. Like, what are they we doing? smoke we different. We fart different. Yep. Look, Pedro, how did you end up with me? I was in the streets, you know, working or whatever. Wounded. And that's how I met Shrek, you know, I would, you know, track, track. link up with him, you know, just kick it, smoke up. And I and I wasn't I wasn't even playing music at that time. And then throughout that time I met the homie. And then we just ended up just like just have cause we want I have always wanted to put in work with guitar, but no one would ever be down to jam it with me and shit, you know? And the homie was down, so I was like, well fuck it, let's fucking jam it. And then, yeah, this fool would already write his own music, and he's like, yo, like, uh, write your own music and shit, you know? Like, you never know how, how that shit could sound. I'm like, for sure. Wrote it, you know, and yeah, that's basically it. ¿Y qué? ¿Se echen una rolita ahorita o qué de los nuevos que traen? Simón, Let's get it, let's get it. Arre, fierro. Bueno, desde SoCal, San Diego, mi raza, presentamos Six, one, Brian nine. Shreds, Kevin Zico. Cortez. Brian Shreds. Mi copa Milo on the base. Kevin Cortez. Y yeah, yeah, seguimos con más trap corridos, drug daily music, straight out of SoCal, baby. Marca los mejores. Drug dealer music. Cosas me han pasado, no lo he podido entender Me la paso yo pensando en lo del ayer Mi padre me cuida desde el cielo, sabe que Agradecido siempre por él yo estaré las cosas cambiaron con la clica, me junté Viajecitos pa'l Bacama, si es que hay estrés Vivo la vida de lujos a mi estilo Banda, coca, carros deportivos No soy de tener muchos amigos Los tres que andan aquí conmigo 
Y si quien empezó hacemos ruido El cuente fajado va conmigo Pero se replicó en mi estilo Eso es algo que no va conmigo De Sevilla, California Kevin Cortez Drug dealer music Quedó como no, muchas gracias. Ea, saludos a todos. De las rolitas inéditas con mi copa Kevin Cortés, suena algo así. Varias cosas de mí no lo voy a negar Soy un loco en la cama que las hace hablar de más Si no se puede olvidar Le doy pa' dentro y suspira la hago sentir algo especial cuando la tengo por detrás Tus palabras no me ofenden Sé que quedaste en el ayer No eres nada especial Ni tu nombre de recordar En el pasado te dejé No me acuerdo ni quién eres Ya no me andes buscando Que la vida sin ti aquí sigue la que diga va a cambiar mi forma de ser y pensar Guárdate tus comentarios, expresará mi lírica Así nací, así seré, relajado ando al cien Y con tu morra no también, mándome uno de verde Sigo ganando billetes, me alegra mi poder saber Que besar de verme y crecer, de rodillas tu mujer tener Siguen odiando y no más, vivo mi vida y no hago más Las ratas tienen envidia, el queso te quieren bajar Bien Wonder, cómo no Gracias por el drug dealer music. Muchas gracias, muchas gracias al compa Wunder por tenernos hoy presentes. Compañita, compañita, yo hago. Sí, yo bien Wunder right here. What's up, what it do?